Hello there guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I wanted to show you guys how to add or remove your card from Apple Keychain or when you go to Safari and you want to uh, automatically get your card added or well, say for example you're buying something from the shops. So I'll just give an example. I'm buying clothes and it's uh, time to check out. Now it's uh, time to add your card details. So with the iPhone, obviously, you can save your card details when you scan it, or you can manually add it. So it saves onto your Apple Keychain, which I've got enabled. Now, if you wanted to ever remove it because your card's expired, or you want to add a new one or something like that, or just remove it just to give it a nice clean look, or just rename them. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that because um, I couldn't find out how to do it first. So I used to have all my expired cards, so many different numbers. So I'd have to memorize like my last four digits of my card just to remember which card I'm using. So what you do is you go to settings, scroll down to Safari. There it is. And then you scroll down to autofill. So autofill, and then here you can see saved credit card. So obviously with this one, you might need your face ID or your fingerprint or password, whichever you have chosen. So as you can see on my one, there's my cards. So obviously I've done it now, but to re I've renamed all mine. So now it has the bank names. So then I, at least I know which bank I'm using. Otherwise, I'll just have your like your long card number, which is a bit confusing because I can never memorize them. So now I've rechanged, well, I've changed that. You can delete them. So if you press edit, you know select which one you want to delete so you can delete or cancel it up to you so if you want to remove all your old ones so literally edit it remove all the old ones the expired ones delete it so just have a nice clean look so it's is easy to find your card and to edit it so what i've done obviously you can see that i put my american express as mx my curve bank my john lewis santander so if you want to do that what you do is you actually literally click on so your one might be it might have your actual card number or your name on it so automatically they just put something on there so you just click on it what would happen is basically for example tsp if i clicked on that what would happen is you'll have your name your tsp card number your expiry date and then the description of the card so that might be your long card number or your name so obviously i'm not showing my one because that's my card number and everything but that's how it's going to be so what you're going to do is just press on the description and write down what bank or whatever description you feel like putting then just to remind you what card you're using so it just makes it easier you can change your card holder name your card number expiry date things like that which is quite good and obviously if you want to add it there you go add credit card as well so you can use your camera or manually enter it so that's how you would do that so then next time you go into safari and you want to buy something it'll um, just show up it'll just show your card name it will be so much easier so that's what i've done it as so it choose, so it just basically gets all my bank cards name so that way i know which card i'm using so that's something that i wanted to show you guys obviously i didn't know how to do that and i thought i'll show you guys it'll make life a little bit more easier so thank you for watching guys please like share and subscribe